Hello. Over the past few months, news media outlets have exposed allegations of many men in high-level positions engaging in inappropriate sexual behavior, including sexual assault. We've also heard the voices of many women and men who have bravely shared their personal stories as survivors of sexual harassment through the Me Too movement. It would be naive of me to think that any organization as large and complex as Hack is immune to misbehavior, sexual or otherwise. We are not. We are, however, aware of the impact this type of behavior has on the survivors and the college community. It is for this reason that we take allegations of sexual harassment seriously, investigate them promptly and thoroughly, and take the best course of action for resolution. As employees, you should familiarize yourself with HACS policy related to the prohibition of harassment and the college's zero tolerance approach to harassment. Be familiar with your role as a responsible employee of the college and be aware of employee obligations pertaining to policy adherence. These obligations include acknowledging receipt of the harassment policy, participating in training on the policy, and serving as a mandatory reporter in matters of harassment. Training on the policy is provided to new hires in new employee orientation and to all other employees online on a routine basis. Students can find out about information on Title IX and preventing sexual harassment by going to page 44 of the Student Handbook. Title IX is also discussed at New Student Orientation and referenced on course syllabi and can be found at hack.edu slash Title IX. We provide you with information about what sexual harassment is, but I want to be clear about what you should do if you believe you have experienced harassment or are a bystander to sexual harassment. If you are a student and you believe you have experienced sexual harassment, or you, as a bystander, have observed what you believe is sexual harassment, please contact one of the names on the screen. Please pause this video so you can take note of their contact information. If you are an employee and believe you have experienced sexual harassment or have observed what you believe is sexual harassment, please contact one of these individuals from Hack's Office of Human Resources. Please pause the video again so that you can take note of their contact information. If you believe yourself to have experienced sexual harassment, please speak up. Processes are in place to help you. If you are a bystander, someone who overheard inappropriate language, witnessed inappropriate touching or physical conduct, or viewed inappropriate texts or emails, but was not necessarily the target of the harassment, speak up and tell one of the contacts identified earlier. There may be others who have witnessed similar events, but were too afraid to come forward, made excuses for what they saw, or just didn't feel like it was their place to get involved. If you are afraid, the college does not retaliate, nor does it tolerate retaliation against someone who files a complaint. If you're not sure that your experience meets the definition of sexual harassment, talk to one of the individuals listed earlier. They will listen and ask clarifying questions. If you don't want to get involved, you should know that all employees, you and me, are considered to be mandated reporters when it comes to harassment. All employees, students and guests of HACC have the right to work, learn, and carry out their responsibilities in an environment free from all forms of harassment in accordance with federal and state laws. Please bookmark this video so you can refer to it should you need it in the future. Please remember, if you see something, say something. Thank you.